You should have your ring back. No. Danny gave it to you. You should have it. Thank you. It was a lovely service, I thought. Yes. Father Joe's eulogy was very good. You spoke beautifully. I wanted to be honest. You did very well. In a few weeks, I'll probably start going through Danny's things. I'll give you a call. Um, you can see if there's anything that you... anything that you want. I should probably start now, but I, I just can't. No, there's no hurry. Take your time. Be good to yourself. They don't... They don't tell you how to handle a situation like this. I don't think there is any way to handle it. No, I suppose not. I should start cleaning up. I'll help you. Since it's already awful, I'd like to talk to you about Charlie. What? Charlie. Danny told me about her. I, I know he sends her mother money every month. I'd like to help with that if I could. I think it's something Danny would want. What are you talking about? Danny told me about her when we first started dating. About his daughter? <laughs> his daughter. I, I know, I know, but with Danny gone, I just need... Abby, Danny didn't have a daughter. Really, Alice? I, I know you didn't approve, but this is your granddaughter. It's so old-fashioned, especially for you. Abby, there is no daughter. Well, this is Annie. Annie? Mm, my niece's daughter. They live in Texas. Is she eight? She's 13 now, I think. Maybe 14. Where did you get this? Danny gave it to me when I asked for a picture of, of his daughter. This came in a Christmas letter, I think. We're not very close. Um, we went down for the christening. They didn't even come to this. And the christening was the only time that we've ever seen her. <laughs> If this isn't Charlie... There is no Charlie. Are you sure? Don't you think I'd know? Uh, yes. Why would Danny make something like this up? I don't know. He sends $335 each month. Well, that's the amount that he puts in his savings account. Could you have missed it somehow? Like, if he'd seen someone in secret? Oh, that would break my heart. Who did he say the mother was? Chloe. Chloe? Well, a girl in his class drowned when he was in the fourth grade. She was named Chloe. <laughs> did he like her? Oh, um, we knew her parents. Nothing out of the ordinary, just school events. Oh, and the funeral, it was awful. It's the worst thing a mother can... This is weird. Well, maybe, maybe he just said it before you got serious. You know, like, like one of those little lies that you just tell. He wasn't very imaginative. That's for sure. Except for this one little thing. He was so... He just lit up when he talked about her. I, it was one of the reasons I fell in love with him. He just made up a whole daughter? 
What else was he lying to me about? completely gone. I wanted to meet her someday. We were going to take a road trip to see her after the wedding. It would have been wonderful to have a, a granddaughter. She would have had his eyes. That crooked little grin when he knew he was in trouble but you forgave him anyway. <laughs> That grin got him out of a lot of messes. <laughs> and of course, all the boys would be in love with her. <laughs> of course. It would have made him crazy. <laughs> oh, he'd have been terrible. And wonderful. And wonderful. I'm going to miss them both. Me too.